I'm here on St. Simon's Island at the original church that the Wesley brothers first started and they founded. Here's my wife, Diana. Beautiful church, one of the most beautiful grounds that I've ever seen with all the Spanish moss and the gigantic trees in the background. They were here when the church first started. We just wanna pray for our Methodist and Wesleyan brothers in the Lord. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you for the experience to come out here and visit. We're just reminded of how you've moved across the years in so many different times and places. And I'm asking you, Jesus, would you help to unite the Methodist church? They've been going under uh, so many different divisions lately, especially regarding your word. I pray that they would stick to the biblical truth of your word regarding all things, whether marriage or all the other elements, and that you would continue to preserve your message of the gospel, the message of hope, the message of Jesus. Please, God, would you let your spirit pour out upon the Wesleyans and the Methodists and all the offshoots and give revival in Jesus' name. Lord, I just agree with Bruce. Lord, I pray, God, that you would knit them together in love. Lord, I pray that there would be no separation for those who are in Christ Jesus. You've knit us together in love, and I pray, God, that you would just cause your bride, your church, to come together. God, make us one bride, one church, one body, united in love. And I pray, God, that revival would again break out, yes. just like you did with John Wesley and Charles Wesley was here. Lord, I know it didn't happen until after he went back, but... God, we're clinging to those historic promises and those things that you've done. We're not asking for it to be the same thing that happened then, but we're asking for a new wave, a new wave, a new um, form of however you want to do revival. And God, I just pray right now that you would knit us together in love. Unite the bride, unite your church. Make us one as you and the Father are one. Amen.